Hey, I'm Matt with 96.1 WEJZ. Xfinity stores are popping up everywhere in Jacksonville, making it more convenient and fun to shop anything Xfinity. What's this I keep hearing about bring your own phone? So basically you bring in an eligible device. Okay, I'm gonna stop you right there because I'm not gonna remember any of this. Can you download it to my brain? Give me your hand. Ah, I could bring an eligible phone to an Xfinity store to get Xfinity Mobile included with Xfinity Internet to save money. Unlimited talk and text, access to over 18 million Xfinity Wi-Fi hotspots, and no line access fees for up to five lines, which I can customize to pay for data, pay by the gig, or get unlimited data. That was awesome. Can you tell me about the Xfinity X1 voice remote? So setting up your X1 voice remote is really easy. Um, once you have your cable box set up, your remote will detect the television and prompts will be on screen on instructions on what to do next. That's really easy. Yes. Remember uh, the days where you had to get like a, a big piece of paper with a bunch of codes, three digit codes, and you had to like punch it in manually and uh, that one didn't work, that one didn't. Remember that? No. It's really easy to access anything. You can access your favorite shows and movies, your favorite actors' bios. You can access uh, the, your favorite games that are on and their scores, mm -hmm. as well as um, Netflix and YouTube. Yeah. You can even access your DVR recordings as well. Love the DVR recordings. Remember the days of uh, VHS and Betamax? Well, another cool thing about the remote is you can ask it to pull up your front door camera if you have our home security. Mm -hmm. And it'll pull up your front door camera on the television. So you see all the footage on my TV screen. Mm -hmm. And then Excellent. if you needed to view your bill, you can ask it to pull up your account. Or mm -hmm. if you need to pay your bill, you can say pay my bill and it'll pay your bill that way. I well. love that. Remember the days when you had to actually had to write a check and put it in an envelope and then put a stamp on it and, and mail it? Thank you.